Baldur's Gate is another one. It's not a triple A game. It's not a triple A game at all. It was a two A game at most for the developers they had for it. Same with Hell Divers. Hell Divers was another one. Wait. It was Hell Divers. Hell Divers is a game. Hell Divers is a game. Okay, so wait. What's the premise of Hell Divers? I can't explain it that well without you looking it up. The a reason bit. the reason I said this Here is because Hell Divers is a novel. Here you go. Is a novel series. I'll, I'll talk a little bit about it, but Hell Divers is pretty much there's three different races, and then including yourselves, but you have aliens, your robots, and then your futuristic aliens, aliens, robots, and Zerg. That's what it's pretty much. So you have your three different races there, and you're pretty much. They have seasons in the game where you have to push back the enemy to reclaim land. So you'll be doing, like, escort duty, or you'll be doing um, mine cleanup or reclaiming certain items you left there. But you can build your own layout. Watch your mic. You can build your own layout. So you can. I can go in as an assault trooper. Someone else can go in as a jump trooper or a shock trooper. So you can build out your layouts across the board. Helldivers is one of the best kept secrets for players. You all share the same screen, and you're all running together. Why haven't we been playing this? I brought it up before. No, you have not. I have. No, you're full of shit. On the Spooky Spook channel, I brought it up. I was like, oh, we should play this. And then you're like, but Risk of Rain. Okay, you're not wrong. Risk of Rain is pretty Risk good. of Rain 2 is the game. Agreed. Agreed. And it put... It put Hell Divers to shame only because I didn't have to share a screen with people. Which, by the way, I'm upset because we need to do some more Risk of Rain with your brother. Once he gets back and gets his new laptop in, because he bought the same laptop I did, 